Hi everyone, welcome to the Lotus Goddess. Hope everyone's doing well and staying safe. Um, so for this reading, I thought I was going to do a general, just like pull out the charms and do a reading, but I think I should do something different. I haven't decided yet. Let's, what should I do? Hmm. Okay. I'm going to do a Divine Masculine reading. Let's do a Divine Masculine reading. Da -da. Or should we change it up? Let's do Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine. Dun -dun. <laughs> yeah, let's do this. Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine reading. Okay. See what messages come through. So this is a double reading. I'm gonna do divine masculine, divine feminine. And just keep in mind that this is a general reading. Just take what resonates. Holy moly. Okay, so this is not going to be for for all because this it looks like a very uh, unique reading and the messages are coming in quite strong in this one looks like something's happening at this time and you will know if it's you or not but this is a message the angels want to say so I will try to share as much as I can with you whoever is going through this okay so where to start um we always start with divine masculine let's start with divine feminine first this time around okay so divine feminine so there's something major happening over here um i see a lot of drama taking place here and this has to do with karmic karmic situation so um this has to do with a karmic person uh who is actually uh talking about something maybe could be in regards to a divine feminine or there was some kind of um conversation that took place um uh, with like this involves a karmic person okay so this karmic person could have had a discussion about divine feminine or somebody mentioned about divine feminine to the karmic person um something that divine feminine i don't think divine feminine is fully aware of um, but angels are showing it here uh, there's some big conversation taking place about divine feminine and this karmic is involved in this karmic uh, conversation and it's quite a heavy conversation um it is quite bitter uh it's going to cause i i feel like it's going to cause some kind of like big commotion uh and this could also involve some kind of family members um and i feel like in this reading there are some people who don't want to get involved they're going to step away when this thing happens Either it took place already or is about to take place because the energy looks pretty strong in this reading. And oh, okay. I got the message here. So this has to do with um, a breakup. Divine Masculine. Um, in this reading, the Divine Masculine either had a conversation or... This karmic person heard about divine masculine wanting to separate from the karmic partner and this caused some kind of argument and the karmic person um, is quite upset at this time about this um, breakup situation and some people have backed off from this um, this situation because I feel like it's got out of hand um, this karmic person is trying to involve other people. Um, what I'm feeling is if the divine masculine has stepped away from the karmic person's life, she is trying to get um, people who are also like connected in some way to kind of like get involved in, in this drama. 
I feel like it's not just between Divine Masculine and the karmic person. This karmic person is kind of like making it bigger. Um, a bigger, uh, it's kind of like, yeah, it's bigger than what it is. Like it is not good, but they're just making it bigger. Like I feel like if you are going to break up with me, this is what I feel if karmic is saying. If you're going to break up with me, I'm going to make sure everybody is here to here to see it like to see what you're doing to me that kind of thing like like she wants um an audience like i feel like she wants people to be involved to to sympathize i feel like she wants a sympathy kind of thing um to play 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 it out in a way to make it feel like um that it's not my fault that this is happening. Look what Divine Masculine is doing, everyone. Look what he's doing to me. That's what I feel. <laughs> that's, it. that's what I feel. Look what he's doing to me, everyone. Look, look, everyone. Um, he's treating me so badly. I didn't do anything wrong. So... That's the first thing I see here. And that's where the Divine Feminine conversation is going to take place. There's going to be discussion. They're going to mention your name, Divine Feminine, in this argument. Um, but it's in your favor, Divine Feminine. Like, don't worry about it. Like, this, it's just going to be in your favor. Um, they're going to... It's like, what I feel, it's like Divine Masculine is going to throw your name to kind of like fight off this karmic energy. Like, your name has become a protection for Divine Masculine. It has become a strength for Divine Masculine to find the strength within himself to stand up to this situation. So you have become a support system without physically being there. So that's why your name is being called out. The Divine Masculine is going to pu push full force with your name on his lips or her lips. Take it as it resonates. You have become their pillar. This, this, um, this situation has been very heavy for the Divine Masculine. Um, and it is going to cause a lot of um, bitterness, negativity. Um, but this is the moment that's going to help release the Divine Masculine out of this. I feel like he is, it's going to help him leave. Uh, because in this reading, I see it has to do with like leaving a type of lifestyle, leaving a home, leaving an environment, that sort of thing. It's going to help him push him forward, like to the new direction. When it comes to Divine Feminine in this reading, I can see Divine Feminine is very blessed. She's very lucky. She started a new way of living. Um, she's carried on a new path. Um, she does look at the past sometimes, but she's already made decisions, um, smart decisions for herself to start a new beginning, a new life for herself. And I feel like Divine Feminine still has the communication open, meaning like she, she still has, she still has her, um, like she has the communication open for Divine Masculine. Like if Divine Masculine wants to connect there is a way of connecting somehow to divine feminine, but there's there's no. Um, I feel like this divine feminine is not really focused on trying to connect to divine masculine. It's more like the communication is open. If he wants to come and communicate, that's fine. But I'm not going to be the first to communicate. Like it's kind of like divine feminine has let it go and released it, and now just let divine masculine be. Okay. Um, so that's what I got for um, the Divine Feminine. Um, yeah, so there's mostly drama here, but it's just going to, um, it's going to be between the Karmic and the Divine Masculine, okay? Um, so now for the Divine Masculine reading, um, 
I see there's a lot of strength for the Divine Masculine. Um, he's no longer confused about what direction to go in. He's starting to face things that he, he was avoiding. Um, there's a lot of things he still is unaware of that was taking place in his current uh, life situation. Um, this is what this is the reason why he was um, delaying things. This this is also the reason why he was living a certain way of life because of his um, lack of knowledge about certain things about this um, person he was with. Um, the divine didn't show the divine masculine in the beginning because this divine masculine had a lot of imbalances within him. And the only way that he could restore that balance and to grow as a divine masculine to um, grow spiritually and be in alignment is if he is put in a situation where he had to learn those lessons so he can um, grow spiritually and to learn more about himself. Um, this person really, uh, turned his life upside down. Like this divine masculine felt very trapped. He thought, um, where did I end up? Um, it feels like a quicksand. Like, I feel like he was, he was just going, like going with the flow, just walking through the, um, through the emotions. Like he was not really um paying much attention and then all of a sudden he started to sink sink in that quicksand and this is uh this is what helped him start to realize that there's something um off in this connection and i can see this divine masculine he he has his third eye open he's alert now he's aware um he's grown a lot spiritually uh he's very um intuitive and he's thinking um he's thinking more um like from different perspectives before i feel like he didn't really put much thought into like in, in case this may happen this might be the outcome like he didn't think about that he just um it was kind of like spur of the moment type of um reaction he had in the past but now i feel like he he's more focused on like if i make this decision this may be my possibilities. This may be the outcomes. Like he's thinking more about those things now. Uh, he had a lot of purging release. Uh, this divine masculine. Um, he is. I can see that he wants to um, communicate somehow to divine feminine. But he's not sure exactly like how to go about it. Like how to start that communication. But he knows eventually that he needs to take the first step. And I think this Divine Masculine is aware that Divine Feminine will, at this point, is not going to be the one to reach out first. Um, this Divine Masculine, he, he knows that he's pushed the Divine Feminine to the point where Divine Feminine has released the Divine Masculine. So now the Divine Masculine is just trying to be stronger, trying to figure out like how to go about um, moving forward in his life and he he doesn't want any part like any he doesn't want any kind of love triangle third party he doesn't want any of that he just wants to move forward in a very um, loving respectful manner with divine feminine like there's loyalty here in this reading and I see that um, he's released a lot of the old habits, old way of doing things, old way of thinking, um, his feelings um, about love, about um, connection. It has changed. It's, it's more selfless now. So it's more like he thinks about what the other person is feeling and what the other person is um experiencing now um there's still a little bit of an immaturity here i think it's because uh he he still needs to um not take things too lightly i think the procrastination is part of his immaturity like oh i think it's okay like it took this long i think it's okay to you know 
um, get things ready before I can, you know, move towards divine feminine. Like, I feel like this divine mask is still not realizing about like time, like time is important here. Um, priority, what's the priority here? Um, in that way, he is still immature when it comes to, to those kind of habits, like procrastination, um, uh, knowing what, when to do what. Um, I think he's still in the headspace of trying to plan things out. Like he's still thinking, thinking about how to do things, but it's more thinking and less doing when it comes to divine feminine. And it could be because he has recently went through or is going through this um, karmic um, disaster, whatever this, um, this, uh, it looks like uh, an outburst, some kind of outburst that's about to take place or has recently take place. Uh, it, it looks like a messy, um, it looks like some kind of messy, um, situation that he has to face with this karmic person okay so that's the reading for today if you like this divine masculine divine feminine energy reading uh please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already i'll uh, leave a comment below like and thank you all for watching have a great day bye